Hey everybody, this is Ollie. Ollie wants to do a reading um, for all signs. Um, he's still learning how to shuffle, so I'm going to shuffle these up for him. And then he's going to take it from here, okay? He's going to take it and go. Yay. All right. There you go. So wait, how do you like choose the cards and stuff? Do it however your soul tells you, man. However feels good. <laughs> okay. What I'll do is that, uh, darn it. I'm confused on stuff. Like, okay, I think I know what I'll do. You got this? You want me to help you? <laughs> yeah. Okay. How about this? We'll do this. We'll make some piles. Okay. Okay. Pick two cards out of each pile. Perfect. All right. And we'll put those to the side and then read your cards. Okay, so I'm just going to do this one. It's five of cups, I think. Wow. Well, what it looks like is a. The dude's really depressed. It looks like a, he's gone through some hard times. Like, he looks really depressed. But, um, what did I see? Yeah, I think he's depressed. And, uh, this is a three of wands. And, uh, this, I'm looking at it. Um, I feel like. It could someone like start in their own path after they're like getting ready to go somewhere and they're not that prepared but but they're they're just getting ready to go somewhere and uh, sometimes it might be hard for them so they're kind of looking back on you know what they want over all the stuff they really did where they were and I found uh, seven of wands okay so this could mean multiple things with this one I really gotta look at them okay so this is actually kind of hard because well, I'm not that good at this you're either. great at this keep going so uh, He's basically, uh, it looks like he's like trying to like, uh, looks like he's trying to get better with a wand. Like he's gonna attack something. It actually kind of looks like that. It looks like he's just getting ready to attack something. Or he's nervous or, and he wants to get ready for, for what's ha gonna happen next. It's upside down and it's two of swords. If I look at it correctly, it looks like she's training and getting ready for something, but since it's upside down, it's the opposite. She's not training or really getting ready. It's just, yeah. Oh, oh wait, I think I see something. I feel... Now that I look at these two, ooh, the uh, three of wands and five of cups, it looks like he's up. Uh, now that I think about it, it looks like he's like kind of sad that he has to go somewhere. Now that I look at at them, like he's he's looking back on where he went and yeah. It's upside down. Eight of swords. 
It's upside down. And she looks like she's been kidnapped. Okay, let me look at it. Can I show you something about that car? What? Even though she looks like it, wouldn't it be really easy to cut herself free with all those swords? You know what, you're right. Maybe that's a prison she made for herself. To protect herself. Or, or she's trying to figure, figure out ideas that she would do if she was in any of those situations. Yeah. But this is upside down, so she is not preparing for anything. She just decides to be like, like yeah. Seven of Pentagons or Pentacle. It it's up. It's up. It's right side up, and uh, I believe like Pentagons or whatever, or Pentacles or uh, money. Mm -hmm. So that means like, a, a, they're in a new, p I think, I think I get what's happening. So I think what's going on is, uh, I'm just going to tell the story of what we have. The dude's sad and he said that he has to go and he's really preparing for what he has to do next or if he has to do next. And then he's he doesn't do anything really after that, and I think he uh and he did he he did something that made him have uh, lots of money. I don't know if it just means he has ten dollars, but yeah, could mean that. I don't know. Oh, oh, so yeah. I'm, so I'm gonna do it again. I just the trial thing. Go. Go. There you go. Okay. Okay. This should expand the story and figure out what's going on. Figure out if we could get any backstory of why he's, why he's possibly leaving or, or not doing any of this stuff. It just kind of gets to look this. It's a high of priest. Priestress or whatever. High priestess. High priestess. And uh, it's upside down and this looks like the girl relaxed. Actually, she, she's all calm. She has her like got, garden in the background. Um, and look, this is upright. She looks all calm. And then, but it's upside down. So it means like this guy might be stressed or something. Like, Maybe he did something, maybe something wrong happened. There was no uh, King of Swords. It's, uh, it's a king dude, and he has a sword, and it's upright. So, uh, it really looks like he's keeping his sword with him at all times, because... He's a little bit overprotective of something, and like maybe something happened. Could be with this that something happened, and now he's stressed, and so he has protection everywhere he really goes. Or it could just be me. I don't really know. But Queen of Pentacles, uh, set, and then. There's King and Queen of Pentacles. So now that I think about it, I 
I don't know. We'll just have to figure it out. I feel like it might have something to do with a relationship, but it might not. Uh, seven of swords. Uh, the image is a uh, guy packing away on his sword. It looks like he's like uh, taking them all. Maybe when she was done doing really whatever this was, I uh, he took all the swords except it's upside down. So, so that means he left the swords there. He never actually moved them. He he kept them there. And, yeah. You know, I think I know what might be happening, but it's best to get some more content. Four of Pentacons. <coughs> so, uh, <coughs> it's a guy with uh, his Pentacons. There's one on his head, one, uh, one in his hands, and two on his feet. So, oh, there's another Pentacle one. Maybe he's losing money. <coughs> or getting it. Let me look. Okay, so the dude has suffered a hard time. And, and he's getting ready to leave, possibly. So, oh, he's looking back on everything, preparing for the worst that might could happen. And he had lots of money. And he didn't it do anything. No precautions. <coughs> he thought he was... He, <coughs> he thought he was fine time so I think maybe like a broke up happened and she got to keep most of the money and that's why I'm really shows him a four and she kept the stuff or maybe he kept it I don't know but but that's just what I think uh, the devil Literally just the devil. Uh, what else is in the picture? Two people being chained up. Maybe like some slavery stuff happening. So now that's happening. So maybe, maybe he got like a bad job and it's not paying him that well, and that's what it's supposed to. Look like okay. Okay, there you go. So I'm just going to kind of go into so I think the story is complete. Okay. You should keep these. Huh? Keep those. This? Mm hmm Might be part of your story. Yeah, you might be right. <clears throat> okay, so we got number one. Five of uh, months. It looks like he got in a fight. Yeah, it kind of looks like it. So, now what was the break of thing? Okay, so, so, uh, Knight, there's a Knight of Cups. He looks all majestic, ready to go, but it was upside down, so it looks like he had nowhere to go. That was the only real place for him, I think. So, uh, maybe.
maybe I think I think I was right about oh with the heartbreak it shows a heart being broke uh, I think what happened is uh, he got uh, he got into a breakup and uh, uh, she or he got to take all this stuff and stuff and he was left with not that much money she I really hope this gets better because it really looks like they're going through hard times. Wow. First it looked good like they're getting ready to leave when I saw the money and I was like, hey, ooh, this might be a good one. But now I'm just seeing heartbreak. The dude's being left alone. And the devil. It's <laughs> a lot. Uh, I found the emperor. It's an... Uh, the Emperor, I did, I just, I was, I just throw it up to this screen real quick and throw it back so nobody could see it, but, but that was by accident. So, uh, what happened to, it looks like, uh, uh, he's kind of, he's kind of falling in, uh, or no, he's not falling apart, but, uh, he's, he's having a good life, it just, he's not being paid that well enough. It's not really going good for him. So I think it's, he's not really getting that well, and it's, it's this one, uh, well, cause Okay, now that I look at this, it looks like he just got fired. Which card? It's upside down, and it looks like there's an emperor in this sun. He just got fired. <laughs> at least that's what I think. The lovers. Oh, well. Maybe he did get in a breakup real bad. Sometimes breakups feel like getting fired. <laughs> got fired from being that person. <laughs> Okay, two of cups, and there's the, the devil head is about two of them. That's a caduceus. It's actually about strength and healing. Oh, so maybe the guy met with another girl, when they're happy together. Oh, right, so I'm just going to put it all to this side. Now. Uh, the magician. So, uh, if you look on it, yeah, on the table he has a cup, a sword, a wand, and some cash. And remember, if this is the same guy from earlier, he did have cups, a, the wands, and a sword, and some cash. Except it might not be it, and, it, and I might just not make, be making any points. That's actually really good. I never really saw it that way. As being super resourceful, having all of that, making something happen. Yep, because I it looked and I saw he had cups, wand, and a sword, and some cash. That's every element. So he must have gotten his hands on every element. Mm -hmm. Now we look on to here. It's upside down. So it's strength. The dude must be weak. It is. <laughs> Upside down, my fr my brain immediately <laughs> to that they must be weak. <laughs> so a girl or a guy, I don't know, of petting the lion and uh, and uh, well, uh, it must be upside down. So uh, 
he doesn't, he's, he's just weak, he doesn't, maybe he needs to get a gym membership. <laughs> or he decides not you to. You forgot your card. I know. You want some oracle cards to put on there? Yep, after I get, after I do this. Okay. This I'll... is just me. So, look. It looks like he works out of court now. You could. <laughs> I'm sorry. I only see that because he has the little, uh, the little thing that. Uh, That's actually a really good observation the because. Thing. Yeah, the the scales. The yeah, balancing. yeah, he has the scales, and uh, he also has a sword, and he's a king, and uh, I feel like he may have like a job at like the Supreme like Court. Like a judge. Yeah. That's a, or an attorney or something. That's and a really it, good and observation. It's a, and it's a justice. In a, a court. Yeah, court justices. Yep. Oh, that's really smart. That's very smart. So let's see what this has to do. So one tile. Uh, there's some falling. I'll take, take that. If any of them fall, I'm just gonna keep it. See if what it has to change to. Okay. Uh, to make sure I actually got to. I wasn't peeking at them. Got three. It's okay if you peek. Mm -hmm. Oh. I always thought it was against the rules because I'm not going to watch. It's true, you, uh. You never really peeked at them. Uh-oh. You just kind of grabbed them. <clears throat> so I thought if I made it look like I was peeking, everyone would be like, bro, well, you're not supposed to do that. <laughs> well, you're supposed to pick them at random, but if you see them, it's okay. It's, it's you know. Let me grab the book book. I dropped one of the cards I don't want to take. Mm, okay. So let's see what Sears have to say. Let's look. Uh, it's upside down. Tall wife. It's just two aliens. So when it's upside down, so he's short. <laughs> um, all right, but what does it say under that? Okay. Uncertainly, he distrust guard distrust. There's trust guarded. So, so he's guarded, but he's not trusted. But it was in reverse. Hmm? So it was in reverse, remember? So he's certain now. He's not guarded. And he does trust. Because he's opening up to something new. Oh, yeah. And he's a part of Supreme Court. Mm hmm So people... So he is trusted with things. So that means he's... he's good at that because why wouldn't they they would trust him if he if he's really the guy running and all I want to trust him he's the one figuring out who is guilty pleadians it's a, it's a girl talk unexpectual love unconditional love of excitement and laughter what does that mean loving somebody regardless of anything that they do um it it doesn't mean that they necessarily will put up with anything that they do but they'll love them regardless um and it means like you know being able to have excitement and laugh and enjoy life still oh so it this was a pretty sad story but now it's getting better mm -hmm. now what uh, earth's Element, decree, survival, adapt, adaptable, and realable. And what? Railable, I don't know. And reliable. Reliable. What's that supposed to mean? Um, there's somebody that is very stable, somebody you can depend on, somebody who, um, 
who can adapt to changes really well. Really grounded energy, because ground and earth, you know. Mm. Uh, Rhonda. Uh, Ves Vesica Pisces. Vesica Pisces. So, di dive Divine fem Feminine. Divine. Divine Feminine. Divine um, Feminine. Feminine. Birth, birthing. Fertility. 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 What does that mean? It means, um, the Divine Feminine is typically like the maternal energy. Um, it doesn't necessarily mean that it has to be a girl or a mother. It means like it has to be somebody who's creative, somebody who brings things to life. Somebody who, um, it's like what I said earlier about the Divine Feminine being very artistic and very, um, you know, hey, compassionate, I nurturing. I can see the car through the camera. Yeah. <laughs> it's upside down, and what does it say? Siren. Oh, I know what a siren is. They play their music. This is an alien. It's a different, oh. different siren. Yeah, <laughs> great observation. But I though. see mermaids. Is it? Let me see. Look, there's mermaids. Oh my gosh, maybe you're right. They're alien mermaids. And sirens, what they do is that they play their music to lure their people so they can get them to crash or to kill them. Yep, this is upside down. So, let's see, responsibilities, lessons, and going up. So it's on one. So they're not taking responsibility, not learning their lessons, and not growing up. <laughs> it might be the guy was at the there, but it can't be that guy because you need a you need a high. Uh, you you need to know lots of lots of things, and you need to. Uh, Ooh, ooh, stay stable to all of so it. So you think it's a different energy? Maybe it's girlfriend. Yeah. It could be. Um, it could be. I mean, a siren is typically, I mean, oh wait, that's Syrian, actually. I just saw it. Okay, uh, but yeah, no, but going back to sirens, though, like sirens are typically female. Uh, they lure people in. They kind of you know? Yep. Um, but since it's in the reverse, this could be somebody of the past, too. That, like, the person that they broke up with, per perhaps. Pentagon, Hermes, protection, idolism. Isn't that just money and... Well, I think... It's the pentagram. It represents humans. If you look at it, it's the shape of a human. Two legs, two arms, head, you know, um, and it really represents um, being divinely protected, having peace, um, you know, like when we, when we draw a pentagram, that's a circle of protection, that's a circle where we feel safe to, to interact with the divine, you know. Hmm. It's like a portal. Just like humans are like portals. So like... <clears throat> what do the other cards say? So like a portal to another human because females get pregnant. Mm. And then they're like a portal. And there was the birthing and the fertility. That's potential, yeah. So they're like... So maybe this girl gave birth. Yeah. That's very... It could be like a future baby mama or past baby mama. Cabalia or Cabalia Tree of Life. Cabalia or Cabala Tree of Life. It's a tree. It has little uh, things into agreeing to life lessons. Emotions. Those are called Sephiroths. Each of those dots, they're the Sephiroths. And they represent the different foundations of the tree of life. Um, <clears throat> yeah. 
So that means this guy knows a lot about like. Yeah, see how in this one it says learning, integrating life lessons and emanating that. Whereas this one, it was they were not learning their lessons, not growing up, not taking responsibility. So it's like these are definitely two different people. And I think this would be this guy because he he's a duck. And they wouldn't bring some like some stupid person up to court and then no, drive to Jackson. They would. They, they would. <laughs> I'm gonna be real. They would and they have. But you know, they should be honorable people, right? And so we're looking at it from that perspective that this is somebody who's fair and balanced with the scales, right? So we're seeing a fair a fair one. <clears throat> yeah. What's the last one? Last card. Eben. Reading between the lines and intuition. Intuition. It's a smart dude. <laughs> it's a psychic dude. Maybe. Somebody who can read between the lines. Somebody who's very mysterious, very intuitive. That would be very strong. Like, I would say almost an attorney. Also, attorneys are very resourceful. They have every element that they need to make anything happen, right? Yep. <clears throat> I looked at this and I realized that the, all, he had he had all of those things. Like, he had that, that, uh, the, so, the sword, the uh, tentacles over here. Yep. <clears throat> so, uh, yeah, that's... So, basically, it means that some people... Or not some people just well what's happening in in the in your life or whatever uh uh you're you're kind of sad gonna go somewhere and then you're preparing for the best really and then you're uh, you you have lots of cash lots of money which he, he would if he works for the courts right yep but then he go. But then he doesn't really train for the worst. He really thinks everything will go nice. Then, I think a breakup happened. Um, right here. Yep. And then you can see that he's stressed. I'm going to put all of these guys. But then everything is made right again. So everything's stressed. He's <clears throat> too overprotective. If, and then she gets to take most of the money. And he's left with a couple of dollars left. So well, think about that for a second. What if he's not the judge, but they had to go to court, and he lost the money that way? Oh. Mm-hmm. That's a potential. So I look at this, and I look at that. Doesn't he have all elements? And you said that yeah, judges need then all elements. maybe he didn't lose it all. Or maybe he didn't even lose most of it. Maybe what he lost cups his emotions. He felt like he wasted his emotions here. <clears throat> and, um, yep. yeah, because, like, if you look, he's got his pentacles here. And here, it's, like, where he meets this new person, right? This new person that, like, with the... That he wants to offer a new cup to, right? Because he still has two cups behind him. Oh, yeah. Him. You can look. Look. You can even see they both have the same headband. Yeah, see? They're meeting in, in public. And, like, I feel like, yeah, they meet each other. And then that's where, you know. That's where everything goes, right? Like, like maybe like, nobody lost money in particular because, like, both of them still ended up having pentacles at the end. But they lost each other, right? Sometimes, yep. that's more valuable than money. You did really good, Ollie. Yay. <laughs> High five. <clears throat> Alright, what's your closing statement? Do you, like, what happened so far? No, or? how do you say goodbye to the camera? What's your, what's your thing? Goodbye, and I hope all of you up. Uh, Figure your shit out. No, no. I'm kidding. I'm just kidding. No, just no. <laughs> I hope all of you do not put on your seatbelt when you're already driving. <laughs> well, 
They should wear a seatbelt when they're driving. But, but don't... Oh, don't. so put it on first before you start driving the car. Yeah. That's smart. That's smart. I like that. <laughs>